Okay, we are up and running. So, hello. Hello, everyone. Uh, if anyone watches this ever. Uh, but this is my second attempt at a speed run for the game Portal 2. And uh, I have no previous experience in speed running. I don't think I'm doing this correctly, but I just want to play it really fast and see how what, what my time is. So if anyone that watches this one has watched my last speed run, or AKA my first speed run of this game, um, my times are going to be significantly different. The, on my first speed run through this game, I did not start the timer until the portal opened, uh, in quotes. You'll, you'll, you'll know what that means after, uh, after you see the actual split that I get into here. But I didn't start the timer until the game kind of was already about eh, roughly like five minutes into the game. So... There's going to be a, an extra five minutes regardless on this one because I'm going to start the timer at the very beginning. When I hit start after the first load screen, uh, once the first load screen finishes, that's when I'm going to start my first. I'm going to hit start for the uh, for the whole game. So that's going to be the main difference. Uh, other than that, it's still going to be me being really, really terrible at speed running and just trying to get through this as fast as I can and drinking along the way and having a good time. I sprained my ankle, so I figured it's the perfect time for me to start uh, tracking my speed runs. So, without much further ado, let's get into this thing. I have multiple, um, I have multiple uh, splits set up over here. A little bit different than my last one as well. I'm sure. I think I only had like eight splits on my last one. So I think I've got a about a dozen here, a little bit more than a dozen. So that'll be a little bit different as well. Uh, but other than that, we are gonna go. So here we go, single player, Portal 2, speed run as fast as I can. And as soon as the load screen comes in, or as soon as the screen stops, I'm hit and go. So here we go. And three, two, one, go. Good morning. Game on. You have been in suspension for 50 days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Good. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. There is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. This is art. This is you art. You hear a buzzer. <laughs> when you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. You should now feel I gotta reflect on some jazz music for a minute. If you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. And now we're gonna go back to sleep. Because that's what classical music really does. Good. Now, please return to your bed. Now, the second awakening. After everything broke for several Good years. You have been in suspension for... Nine, 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 this courtesy call Hello? Is Anyone in there? Ah! Ah! Oh, God. Oh, right. You look... Wheatley's gonna come um, talk some shit. Good. And he's gonna Good, disappear actually. into the ceiling, okay? into that box. Are, are you, and well, then he's gonna come back that. out, I'm actually sure ask me a few questions, and then we're gonna move Just into the actual facility. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm, stay, stay so here calm, we go. Prepare. It's all so enjoy prepare. this time, enjoy the dialogue, while I right. sit here and Don't basically move. do nothing. I'm gonna get us out of here. Oh, you might wanna hang on to something. Word of advice, up to you. You all right down there? Can you hear me? Hello? Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. But don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although if you do if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying at all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me, just say yes. Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you just you just jumped. But never mind, say apple. Apple. 
Okay, you know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. Okay, now we get into the real stuff here. All this reactor core are now non-functional. But again, I'm going to react to It's all just uh, cutscenes and animation. So. Okay, look, I wasn't going to mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. How are you doing down there? You still holding on? The reserve power ran out, so of course the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Hold on, this is a bit tricky. And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Why should I be kept informed? You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. Why? It's close. Can you see? Am I going to make it through? Have I got enough space? Uh, just, just got to get through here. Okay, I just got to concentrate. And whose fault do you think it's going to be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? Alright, see, now I hit that one. I hit that one. Okay, listen, we should get our story straight, alright? If anyone asks, and no one's going to ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive, alright? Not dead. Still the best soundtrack okay, in any game ever created, there. and I'll say it every time I play this On the other side of that true. wall is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. Okay, we're coming into the portal will open. And like I said, I think it's about a Good five minute split, so... That is not a docking right station. So there's one mystery solved. Uh, I'm going to attempt a manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Hold on. Almost there. Remember, you're looking for a gun that makes holes. Not bullet holes. But don't worry, you'll figure it out. Seriously, do hold on this time. And away we go. Five minutes right there at the top. So Hello. I'm gonna try and shoot and this again, clipboard into this toilet. To the aperture science if this clipboard center. makes it in the toilet, I don't we have to speed We are currently experiencing technical like difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic oh. significance <laughs> beyond our control. That one was However, close. thanks to emergency testing protocols, yes. oh. testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide yes. instructional oh. and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of okay, environmental, okay. social, economic, or structural collapse. The portal will open, and emergency testing Next will begin coming. in three, two, one. And portal opens. Next split. So yeah, it's five and a half minutes of dialogue at the beginning of that day, basically. I may have missed some Cube because of and button based testing remains an important tool for science, for even in a dire emergency. Around. If cube and button based testing caused this emergency, don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. Now watch, this is going to be the longest elevator ride in history. Damn it, I really need to figure out <laughs> when to go in the elevator on that one to make it sh a short elevator ride. That's that's a where a lot of the time saving comes in on this game is getting the short elevators. If and you I'll explain those down on, your the neck. on this map Relax. after I after I show you back short elevator and apply ride. immediate pressure to your temples. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation will so may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. Try it as much as I can, but I am not great at that. I've never really practiced it. I've never really been shown the proper technique. Oh, come on, for bunny hopping. So, um, I know there's something, it's something to do with the mouse wheel. I'm decent at it, but I just, I've never really studied it or practiced it a whole bunch, so. Good. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Before re-entering a relaxation so, vault at short the elevator coming. testing, Please take a moment right to after write the dialogue, down the results of your dialogue. test. Watch. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will revive you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. Oh, that was a long elevator too. No! So you want, the, you want it to fade to black right after the dialogue stops, or even before the dialogue, if you can do it really well. Um, there's a couple maps I'll be able to do that on. But if the Earth is currently governed by a of animal king, sentient cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable of listening to it. Hey, you made it. There should be a, a portal. Oh! Portal gun. Hello? Can you see the portal gun? Gonna, last time I tried this, I tried to jump and grab it, and I missed it, so I'm just going to bypass that. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to work. 
So I'm just gonna make my way through these hallways as fast as I can with I'll a few jumps. Some emergency testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided okay, with one bad. copy of good. the laws Second of chamber. robots. Let's okay. see if I can get a short over here. If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please uh, note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Maybe? Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. Oh my god, these long elevators are killing me. <laughs> uh, I promise you guys I'm going to get a short elevator here in one of these, one of these maps, I promise. Poop. That's I, that is not ideal right now. This next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed in three, Come on. two, there we go. one. Don't you roll off of there, punk ass fucking brick. And of course, this game's gonna give me as many problems as it, as it can right now while I'm doing this speed run because that's what, how speed runs go. And it's a speed run, so that's just how it works. Oh, I missed off. Oh, I glitched out the dialogue. There. I wonder how that worked. Oh, did it too fast? I'm cool with it, but I bet it's a long elevator. It's not. That was a short elevator. See how it just went to black immediately? We're looking for those every time. If the Enrichment Center is currently being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or other objects from space, please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate part of the test. Hate the staircase. I made it! Yay! And there, and there. And I don't need the shield for this one. I'll just run out and catch it. There we go. Got her. Slap this on this button here. Well and done. Off we go. The Enrichment Center reminds you that although circumstances may appear bleak, you are not alone. All aperture uh, science personality constructs will remain functional in apocalyptic, low-power environments of as few as 1.1 volts. Yeah, I missed it. I've been noticing that if you enter the elevator in between their sentences after they stop, the elevator will be a fast elevator. But if you miss it by a few words, it'll be a long elevator. So. I need to learn the dialogue a little bit more. I'm getting there. This next test applies the principles of momentum to movement through portals. If the laws of physics no longer apply in the future, God help you. Oh yeah, whoops. Smarter than that, come on now. Son of a bitch. That's okay, not the worst thing in the world. If you are a non-employee who has discovered this facility amid the ruins of civilization, welcome. And remember, testing is the future, and the future starts with you. There we are. That was a good jump. I like that. I'm into that. I can do this. Throw that there and see if I can hit it again. I can. Yay! Made it. Nice. Good work getting this far, future starter. That said. If you are simple-minded, old, or irradiated in such a way that the future should not start with you, please return to your primitive tribe and send back someone better qualified for testing. Oh, actually, that was pretty good. It's a pretty short elevator right there. Not bad. I try and catch them in between the sentences, but sometimes it just doesn't time up right, so... To ensure that sufficient power remains for core testing protocols, all safety devices have been disabled. The Enrichment Center respects your right to have questions or concerns about this policy. Hey! First I'm up here! Oh, brilliant! You did find a portal and gun! And now we get to sit oh, here and listen to him talk for a few Do you know what? It just goes to show, people with brain damage Quite a lot of these are the real little heroes in, this in the end, aren't they, at the end of the day? A Brave. Slow dialogue okay, listen, moments. let me... But that's okay. ...lay something on you here. It's pretty heavy. They told me never, never, ever to disengage myself from my management rail or I would die. But we're out of options here. So, get ready to catch me. All right, on the off chance that I'm not dead the moment I pop off this thing. On three. Ready? One. Two. Three! That's high. It's w it's too high, isn't it, really, that? All right, going on three just gives you too much time to think about it. Let's uh, go on one this time. 
Okay, ready? One. Catch me, catch me! Ow! Ow. I am not dead. I don't know dead. if you can ever I'm catch me off of that rail. <laughs> I've tried it a thousand times. Plug me into that stick on the wall over there, yeah? And I'll show you something. You'll be impressed by this. Um. Yeah, I can't do it if you're watching. Seriously, I'm not. I'm not joking. Can you just turn around for a second? All right, you can turn around now. Bam! Secret panel. I right open. While your back was turned, and off we go. Look at this! No rail to tell us where to go. Oh, this is brilliant. We can go wherever we want. Just hold on, though. Where are we going? Seriously. Hang on. Let me just get my bearings. Um. Just follow the rail, actually. Oh no. Yes. Hello. No, we're not stopping. Don't make eye contact. Whatever you do. No. Thanks. We're good. Appreciate it. Keep moving, keep moving. And away we go. As it, as Wheatley would put it. Probably ought to bring you up to speed on something right now. In order to escape, we're going to have to go okay, through GLaDOS her chamber. Is coming up. And have to she will probably kill us yeah, if, if she's um, awake. Her, uh, facility. And then okay, I'm gonna lay my cards on the table. I don't wanna do it. I don't wanna go in there. Don't don't go in there. She, she's off. She's off. Don't panic over. She's off. All fine. On we go. There she is. What a nasty piece of work she was, honestly. Like a proper man. Do you know who ended up uh, do you know who ended up taking a down? You're not gonna believe this. A human. I know. I know. I wouldn't have believed either. Apparently this human escaped and uh, nobody's seen him since. Oh, still still that's held. That's still good. being held. You did, that's We're a great job. You've applied the, the grid. We're all fine. That's... Ah! I just... Sorry, I just looked down. I do not recommend it. Ah! I just done it again. And the main this room. is the main breaker room. As Look for a switch as, as soon that as says as, escape as, pod. Um, soon right, don't as touch as anything else. Don't interest anything up, else. I don't touch anything else. Don't even look at anything else. Just, well, Actually, obviously, look at everything else I'll wait to, until to GLaDOS find is escape fully pod. Assembled, but as soon as you look at something that doesn't say escape pod, look at something else. Look at the next thing, all right? But don't touch anything else or look at anything. Well, look at other things, but don't. You understand. Can you see it anywhere? I can't see it anywhere. Uh, tell you what, plug me in, and I'll turn the lights on. There go. Let there be light. That's, uh, God. I was quoting God. Oh, look at that. It's turning. Ominous. But probably fine, as long as it doesn't start, you know, moving up. Now, escape pod, escape pod. This is moving up. Okay, okay, no, don't, don't worry, don't worry. I've got it, I've got it, I've got it. This should slow it down. No, it makes it go faster. Uh-oh. Power up initiated. Okay, don't panic. Sorry, All right, okay. stop Try panicking. Ring. Uh, I don't like, know how I can still stop I'm this. watching a few speed um, runs. There's a metal ring right there you can pick up. Oh, there's, there's a pass. Right. Okay, it's fine. A lot of stuff about timing. I'm not very good at that part yet, so... A, 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 um... Next A. split's coming up. A, 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 C. Um, wait, did I do B? Did you have head? Start writing these down. Power up, complete. I don't, okay, 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 power okay, up, complete. All right, new plan. Act natural, act natural. We've done nothing wrong. Hello! Oh, it's you. You know her? It's been a long time. How have you been? I've been really busy. Dead. You know, after you murdered me. You did what? Uh. Oh no! No, 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 no! Oh no, 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 no! Okay, look, we both said a lot of things that you're going to regret. But I think we can put our differences behind us. For science, you monster. I will say, though, that since you went to all the trouble of waking me up, you must really, really love to test. I love it too. There's just one small thing we need to take care of first. Fairly sure I just heard the character hit the ground right there. Hmm. <laughs> this is going to be a long segment. The next uh, segment is about uh, 40 minutes from here. So, no, no, I guess it's not that far. It's, uh... 30 minutes from here. That's when we start our first escape. Here we are. The incinerator room. Be there careful not to trip over Again. any parts of me that didn't get completely burned when you threw them down here. The dual portal device should be around here somewhere. Once you find it, we can start testing. Just like a there it is. There. 
Good. You have the dual portal device. There should be a way back to the testing area up ahead. Once testing starts, I'm required by protocol to keep interaction with you to a minimum. Luckily, we haven't started testing yet. This will be our only chance to talk. Do you know the biggest lesson I learned from what you did? I discovered I have a sort of black box quick save feature. In the event of a catastrophic failure, the last two minutes of my life are preserved for analysis. I hate parts like this I was able, can't run past well, them. forced really, to relive you killing me come again on, come on, come and on, come again, come on, come on. forever. You know, if you'd done that to somebody else, they might devote their existence to exacting revenge. Luckily, I'm a bigger person than that. I'm happy there we to go. put this all behind That'll us be and get back to work. After all, we've think got a lot works. to do, really and only 60 more years to do it. More or less. I don't have the actuarial tables in front of me. But the important thing is you're back. With me. And now I'm on to all your little tricks. So there's nothing to stop us from testing for the rest of your life. After that, who knows? I might take up a hobby. Reanimating the dead, maybe. Sorry about the mess. I've really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, thanks for that. Sarcasm self-test complete. Oh good, that's back online. I'll start Probably getting everything else game, working actually, while you perform this first on, simple test, uh, which involves deadly lasers and how enough, test subjects react when locked in a room with deadly lasers. Right <laughs> Not bad. I forgot how good you are at this. You should pace yourself, though. We have a lot of tests to do. Shit, I think that's a long elevator. Nope, that's not too bad. That wasn't too bad. It's like a medium elevator. <laughs> Okay, about 20 minutes in. This next test involves discouragement redirection cubes. I just finished building them before you had your, well, episode. So now we'll both get to see how they work. There should be one in the corner. Well done. Here come the test results. You are a horrible person. That's what it says. A horrible person. Got it. We weren't even testing for that. Fast elevator. I can readjust. Don't let that horrible person thing discourage you. It's just a data point. If it makes you feel any better, Science has now validated your birth mother's decision to abandon you on a doorstep. Congratulations. Not on that the one test. Just me for some Most reason. people emerge from suspension terribly undernourished. I want to congratulate you on beating the odds and somehow managing to pack on a few pounds. Hey, that was a fast elevator. Right when her dialogue ends, the screen goes black. Ideally, I want that on every one of them, but that just doesn't happen for me. <laughs> one moment. I don't want to wait a moment, GLaDOS. Come on. You are navigating these test chambers faster than I can build them, so feel free to slow down and do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. Shit, I screwed that up. God damn it. I gotta go back through here now and kill myself so I can set the map up the proper way. I told you I was gonna die. Told you. Mother, father. Mr. Falconing, sons of birds. What do you do when you are not destroying this facility? Let's see if I can do this a little bit more gracefully this time. Son of a bitch. I did it wrong again. <laughs> I'm really good at this. I promise I'm really good at this game. Ah, my neighbor's home. All right. What do you do when you're not destroying this facility? Hey, look, I did it right. Look at that. Shot the right color portal in the right spot. Look at me. I know games. I can play games. 
I'll give you credit. I guess you are listening to me. But for the record, you don't have to go that slowly. This next test involves the Aperture Science Aerial Faith Plate. This it was one of part of an initiative to investigate how well test subjects could solve Just problems when they were catapulted into space. Results were highly informative. They could not. Good luck. Let's see if I can get this jump. Uh, I would have this stupid pole. Here's an interesting Funny. fact. You're not breathing real air. It's too expensive to pump this far down. We just take carbon Ooh, dioxide maybe. out of a room. Freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. So you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. I thought that was interesting. Ah, uh, long elevator. That was a very long elevator. <clears throat> Alright. Let's see what the next test is. Oh, advanced aerial faith plates. Well, I have fun soaring through the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass by myself. Oh, sorry. I'm still cleaning out the test chambers. So sometimes there's still trash in them. Watch the speed run where around, uh, smelling, the guy said that you don't have to use... Try to or, avoid yeah, you don't the have to wait for the, the box on the, that comes in after this. You can just use the garbage. But I've tried that a hundred times and she'll disintegrate it. She will definitely disintegrate that trash when you try to use it. So I don't, I don't know how that works, but it's all good, I guess. Oh, uh, I gotta wait for another box. Hang on, hang on, everyone. I screwed that up. Whoops. This is not my strongest speed run already. Hopefully, I can make up some time a little bit later. But. Remember before when I was talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless? That was a metaphor. I was actually talking about you. And I'm sorry. You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head. Which would have made this apology seem insane. That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. Did you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? I'm sorry, I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just- Oh, did I accidentally fizzle that before you could complete the Good test? music in this map. I'm this sorry. This is where the music starts to kick in again. Go ahead and grab another one. But it's subtle. Oh, That's no. That's why I like it. I fizzled that one too. Oh well. We have warehouses full of the things. Absolutely worthless. I'm happy to get rid Wheatley of them. Wheatley Peak, there he is. Nice. Oh, fall through there again. Oh. Can you make it? Oh yeah, made it. Nice. That saved a lot of time. So then you have to go through there. For some reason, the game requires you to take uh, this cube out of the map. I don't know, just like I guess a little. Every test chamber Easter is equipped with an emancipation grill and its exit, I've tried to so that beat test subjects cannot the cube smuggle out, test objects out of the test area. This one is broken. Don't take anything with you. But if you hold on to it when the elevator comes down, she'll fizzle it. If not, look. Saved you, companion cube. So we saved the companion cube right there. It did not fizzle and 
di and we save the line of dialogue. If you hold on to the cube, she'll say, I think that one was about to say I love you. They are sentient, of course, or something like that. And then she says, we just have a lot of them or something. I can't exactly remember. This next test involves emancipation This is one where I'll be able to skip dialogue. Remember, I told you about them in the last test area that did not have one. Right time. And they are so far, so let's see how that works. There we go. Oh, no. The turbines again. I have to go. Wait, this next test Before does require it, some I'm explanation. Let me give you the fast version. This one, since she's I'm already in the middle of the dialogue, I can walk right there. in the elevator. If you have any questions, Skips just... it. Fast elevator. Boom. Saved a bunch of time right there. If you can ever cut them off in the middle of dialogue, that's, that's what you want to do. Well, I'm back. The aerial faith plate in here is sending a distress signal. You broke it, didn't you? There. Try it now. What happened, right? I was just lying there? You thought I was So close. Mm. This plate must not be calibrated to someone of your generousness. I'll add a few zeros to the maximum weight. You look great, by the way. Very healthy. Try it now. Bird, right? Couldn't believe it either. You seem to have defeated its load-bearing capacity. Well done. I'll just lower the ceiling. There we go. And away. So now we are hitting... This is kind of a complicating one, but also a really easy one. Essentially, you just want to keep one portal in the same spot the whole time and just transfer all of your blue portals to these little slabs. If you keep jumping through it, it'll send you back to the initial one and send you to all the right spots. Grab this little laser cube and try and line it up as best you can in the middle of these two so your aim is good for later. And then again, another blue tab there, jump right through it, it'll send you back to the original one and you're back at the top. Look at you, and then sailing you can through the air through majestically. There. Hopefully, like one an shot this orange. Piloting a blimp. And it worked! Hey! That's a pretty accurate little shot and I spend a little extra time there on that. Um, sometimes you can just... There you go. Oh, there sometimes you can just, um, just randomly shoot that and it'll go. Uh, but I wanted to make sure it landed on the landed on the laser. I didn't want to take any chances on it. So, took an extra second. Enjoy this next test. I'm going to go to the surface. This is a little it's bit a longer beautiful test. day out. Um, Yesterday I saw a deer. It's not too bad. If you solve this next test... Maybe I'll let you ride an elevator all the way up to the break room. And I'll tell you about the time I saw a deer again. So you have a cube there. This is kind of the best way, again, but kind of the best way I know how to do these. So um, I'm sure there's, there's much faster ways to get this done, but this is just kind of how I know how to do it. So you better block that. There you are. Oh, okay, jump sideways. That was a sideways jump. I don't know why. Blue here, we'll hit this. I learned this one just the other day, um, just by accident. I accidentally knocked off one of these cubes and it worked out in my favor. So you can jump down here and just run into this, knock it off, and then hit the orange there. And then this one's already on the ground where you need it. You just pick it up and hit the bumper. Fly through the air like an eagle, majestically. Land at the target and place the cube. There we go. Well, you passed the test. I didn't see the deer today. I did see some humans. But with you here, I've got more test subjects than I'll ever need. That was, yeah, that was a quick elevator. That was actually probably one of the fastest I've played that level. That was good. Everything worked out. These bridges are made from natural light that I pump in from the surface. If you rubbed your cheek on one, it would be like standing outside with the sun shining on your face. It would also set your hair on fire. Ooh, so don't I have a really actually good tendency for dying in this map by trying to do it too fast, so that was actually pretty good. A little first try action. Nice! And the cube stayed on? That's rad. That does not normally happen for me, so that's good. Cool. 
uh, I think in the last speed run I did, I screwed up on this map because I have a really good tendency to get it confused with the map that happens later on in the game. And I think I lost Excellent. a little bit of time on that one. But you that, are a predator, that one I just, and that these tests for me. are your prey. Speaking of which, I was researching sharks for an upcoming test. Do you know who else murders people who are only trying to help them? Did you guess there sharks? See how I got in there because that's wrong. The correct answer is see. nobody. Nobody but you is that pointlessly cruel. Oh, of course, now that I said it, it didn't. <laughs> okay, so apparently I know nothing about fast elevators. I should look up a forum. I bet there's one out there that I could look up, but... Good news. I figured out what to do with all the money I saved recycling your one room full of air. When you die, I'm going to laminate your skeleton and pose you in the lobby. That way future generations can learn from you uh, how not to have your unfortunate bone up. structure. You can pass this, Perfect. this point and the not have to listen to all this dialogue. You gotta be quick, but you can do it. I going to have to repair that too. Blech. That's no, too bad. Don't That's get really, really too bad. Cause I'll be right back. That, that would have saved me all the time I lost from the intro. Hey, hey, up here. I found some bird eggs up here. Just dropped me to the door mechanism. Shut it right down. I, ah! Bird! 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 Okay. That's probably the bird in it that laid the eggs. Livid. Okay, look, the point is, we're going to break out of here, all right? Very soon, I promise. I promise. I just have to figure out how to break us out of here. Here she comes. Keep te Just keep right, testing. Remember, you never saw me. I never really saw me. I really wish that wouldn't happen like that. I went and spoke with the door mainframe. Let's just say he won't be, well, living anymore. Anyway, back to testing. That was pretty good there. Hopefully that's... Yeah, that's all right. Doesn't matter, because I'll just snag that. Here. Orange there. And off we go to the end of the, end of the map already. That's nice. That was pretty good. Cool too. I don't like to bunny hop or try to on that. Well because, done. Uh, In fact, you did I've so died well. Twice. I'm going to note this on your file. In the commendation section. Oh, there's lots of room here. Did well. Enough. Yeah, there we go. This next test involves turrets. You remember them, right? They're the pale spherical things that are full of bullets. Oh wait, but I do this that's test a little bit differently than maybe you're supposed Good to be luck. doing it. I just launch that guy, put a circle behind him, Are grab him, still? launch him. Over right here, I just throw a portal under him. <laughs> then here, portal there, portal there, portal there, portal there, and then grab this box. And you go Rambo on these guys. Knock him over, get him down, get him down. Boom, everyone's dead. Put it on the button, get out of here. And then kill this guy on the way out. <laughs> and then away we go. Oh, that was crap. Yeah, I don't think that's the traditional way of doing that map, but hey, it works for me. Sometimes you just gotta go Rambo on their asses. To maintain a constant testing cycle, I simulate daylight at all hours and add adrenal vapor uh. to your oxygen supply. So you may be confused about the passage of time. This, the easiest map is, in the game right yesterday here. Yesterday was your birthday. They could have made this I the first map. Want to know. No problem. Check this out. So you take this box, move it down here, slam it between these two sensors, put a portal there and a portal there. You know how I'm That's going it. to I live missed, forever, portal, but, but you're going to be dead in 60 years? Well, I've been working on a belated birthday present for you. Well, there we go. more of a belated Let's birthday go. medical procedure. Well, technically, it's a medical experiment. What's important is it's a present. Yeah, good elevator. That jumpsuit you're wearing looks stupid. That's not me talking. It's right here in your file. On other people, it looks fine. Oh, this one also, but right here, a scientist has noted that on you, it looks but it's stupid. How I do it. Well, what does a neck bearded old Scrap engineer him. know about fashion? The corner, he probably. Put up some, oh, put up some wait. It's a she. Still, what does she know? Oh, here, wait. It says she has a medical degree. Oh, nice. In fashion. That. From France. 
Again, I think they're setting this one up properly. Let's just kind of waste all these guys. And then hit the button. Oh, you piece of crap. Hit the button. Oh, you piece of crap. There we go. Put a blocker up. And kill this guy. I'm going through the list of test subjects in cryogenic storage. I managed to find two with your last name. A man and a woman. There we go. So that's interesting. It's a small world. I have a surprise waiting for you after this next test. Telling you would spoil the surprise. So I'll this just give you easy. a hint. Uh, blue portal there, it involves me and two people you really haven't have seen in a long because... time. As soon as they start on fire, you can just jump right through stuff and leave those portals placed. Grab this cube, jump back through your blue portal, and it puts you right on the dot. Jump back through here. Try not to get too burned by the laser, but you get, they give you a pretty good piece of time. To get that in, so. Burn up all these guys. The laser sensor. There we go. I think uh, there's a way you can get past all those guys without uh, having to explode them like that, but it's really risky. So. <laughs> I don't know if there's a way to Rambo that one or not. I'm not sure if there is. Maybe. With the cube, if you opened it up and just ran around with the cube to the end. Uh, maybe. I could try it. Yeah. Just take that first cube, set the it laser. It says this next test was designed by one of Aperture's Nobel Prize winners. Oh, no, winners. I guess you couldn't because you need it the cube to set the It doesn't say what the prize was for. Oh, never mind. Well, I know it wasn't for being immune to neurotoxin. No. You think I forgot about your surprise? Oh, okay, actually, that works. I didn't. Oh, In what? fact, we're oh. headed to your surprise right now. Oh, After all no. these years, I'm that getting choked crap, up just dude. thinking about it. That is crap. I had the puzzle completed. <laughs> oh, that is such crap, dude. That is really stupid. Not nah, don't. God damn it, dude. Are you serious? I have never, never struggled like this on this map. You have got to be kidding me, man. I am losing so much time on this map. Are we gonna land this time? Are we actually gonna do it, maybe? Holy shit, man. Thank you, hey, doors open. Wow, that was really sad. That was <laughs> really sad. Uh, she even said her dialogue and everything. She knew I was done, I knew I was done. Game physics did not agree. Then we get a wait. On this next map, I've actually done a lot of work on. Uh, played it through a few times and actually figured out a good strategy for it. A decent strategy for it. I made it all up. Yeah, she's throwing confetti at me. I don't care. Surprise. Okay, let's, go. let's go, let's go, let's go. Open the store. Let me see it. Oh, come on. So the first thing we're if gonna it do makes on this you map, feel any better, they abandoned you at birth. And shoot a portal down so I very so seriously doubt they'd even want to see you. Set here and then launch the bricks. And then as soon as those bricks are launched, we're going right back over there. And we're going to come over here. And we're just going to orange those if we can underneath them. Real, real tight orange gaps. Ah, oh, shit. Uh, he might get me. He might get me. But I got both of them. Ha <laughs> ha. That was amazing. All right. Let's go. That was good. I don't think I've ever done that before. And you can burn him up. There he goes. And then you bunny hop your way, or you try to, over to the other side of the map here with an object. Bunny hopping with objects is tough. All I five feel five. awful Boom. about that surprise. Blue there. Tell you what. Let's give your parents a call right now. Yeah. parents who are trying to reach do not love you please hang up oh this. i think because of that you get a fast elevator but impressive the phone maybe they worked here. at the phone company oh that's right because of wheatley yeah hey see wheatley. how's it going i talked my way onto the old nanobot work crew rebuilding this show they are really small so, oh. i know jerry no i'm on a break mate on a break ah 
Just hang in there for five more... What, Jerry? You can't fire me for that. Yes, Jerry. Or maybe your prejudiced worksite should have accommodated a nanobot of my size. Thanks for the hate crime, Jer. See you in court, mate. Anyway, look, just hang in there for, for five more chambers. Well, you know the old formula. Comedy equals tragedy plus time. And you have been asleep for a oh, while. Okay, what do we so got I here? guess it's actually pretty funny when you do okay, the math. Grab it. I've tried that a few times, but I can't ever seem to grab it. Okay, let's get all of our cubes down first. So that, that, boop. That. That should get down that cube. Hey, oh, just what? I did this last time. God, okay. I just went and got it myself. Just like that. That'll work. Okay, fine. And we'll uh, just move. One. No. No. Oh, God, dude, this is getting crazy. This is getting crazy. I've never struggled like this, man. On those easy jumps, I've, I've practiced these a lot. I've never, never had that weird stuff happen. Of course, there's a timer behind me, and I'm on a very tight schedule, so that actually makes a lot of sense that everything is going wrong. Because that's kind of how it works. these here turrets. I thought about our dilemma, and I came up with a solution that I honestly think works out best for one of both of us. No, that wasn't too bad. Federal regulations require me to warn you that this next test chamber is Oh, this is my favorite map. I love this map because you put good. two portals in and That's the right. map, the, map does the facility is completely great. operational again. They put all the cubes just like basically right where they needed to go. I like it because that weird music. Right I think these test the chambers look even better than they did before. It was easy, really. You just have there to look go. at things objectively, see what you don't need anymore, and trim out the fat. Yeah, yeah, that was good. 46 minutes even. I think we're coming up on the escape. She'll say something about a surprise. I've got a surprise yeah, for go. you after this next so this test. One and the next Not one a will fake, be at the tragic escape. surprise like last time. A real surprise. Oh no, this is it. This is the escape right tragic here. consequences. And here real confetti this time. So she'll turn What's off the going lights. on? Who turned off the lights? And then Wheatley will show up the second hey, buddy, that he I'm speaking in an accent that is beyond her range of hearing. Here we go. Look. Metal ball, I can hear you. Run! I don't need to do the voice. Run! Uh, split. Run! Run! On Come escape. on, I'm closing the door. Okay, quick recap. We are escaping. All right, that's what's happening now. We're escaping. Uh, so you're doing great. Just keep running. Uh, quick word about the future plans that I've got in store. We're going to shut down her turret production line. All right, turn off her hero toxin and then confront. Again, though, for the moment, run! The iron. Come on! Come on! There we go. Nice. Okay, Why so don't you just do it? Too. That's Trust good. me. It's an easier way out than whatever quick. asinine plan your friend came up with. Oh, no, whoa! How, how really stupid nice. does she think we are? Can move, yeah, quite a ways down. Which is really nice. And then it should put us right in the position where we need to move. Come on! Come on! Uh, this is another haphazard part that I don't know if this is how you're supposed to do it or not, but this is how I do it. So, we go with the Rambo ah! turrets again. Look out for gunfire. Probably done to help at this point, but you're a 
okay. Great, come on. Oh. Oh, this way, this way. He is not going to be happy when he comes into work on Monday and sees what you've done, GLaDOS. And we'll try and make oh, our way down you made it through, well no matter how fast okay, follow you do me. this part. We've still got work to do. The, the light um, turning mm, Okay. Off. Just okay, to uh, run past that move. part. And then it'll bring you all the way back to where Wheatley's at, and you have to rerun that catwalk okay. again. All right, so I've got an idea, but it is bloody dangerous. Here it comes. Here we go. And magically, ah! I'm turned around at the end of the catwalk again. Oh, for God's sake. They told this me part gets a little confusing if I ever turned this flashlight dark, on, I, can't really I would see die. My they told me that about everything. I mean, I don't even know why they bothered. So Ooh. hopefully I'll make it through. It's dark down here, isn't it? They Not say that the old caretaker of this place went absolutely crazy. Chopped up his entire staff. The robots. All of the robots. They say at night you can still hear the screams of their replicas. All of them functionally indistinguishable from the originals. No memory of the incident. Nobody knows what they're screaming about. Absolutely terrifying. Though obviously not paranormal in any meaningful way. Okay, alright, bad screens. Those were bad screens. Quick, this way. Here's an interesting story. You might like this. I almost got a job down here in manufacturing, but uh, guess who the foreman went with? Only an exact duplicate of himself, nepotism, ended up giving me the worst possible job, tending to all the smelly humans. The, the, um, sorry, that's, uh, no, I wouldn't say smelly. Just, uh, just attending to the humans. Sorry about that, that just, that just slipped out. I'm a bit insensitive. Um, the smelly humans. Look there's the another wall? wall over here! I thought I, man, I thought I had that one. Oh! I'll tell see, you. that's what I'm saying. Humans. I can't. My contrast oh, is crap. Them. So Just the way they look. Can't really see great. where my target points are. They're dark. Oh, oh, I'm shooting the right one. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful colorful. Cow. Geronimo, jump! Right. Don't die! Don't die! Don't die! Don't well, die! Don't die! Don't die! Don't I'm die! Nice. Take this well. That works. No. Moving quickly. That was good. That was a good jump. That was a really good jump. So the next one is going to be the Wheatley takeover. That's when we re-enter Gladys's uh, chamber and fight her for the first time, and we actually re replace her with Wheatley. So at that point, when I hit the switch, um, when I hit the override switch, is when I'll do that one. Turret redemption lines are not right. Okay, Please one. exit the turret redemption line. I'm grabbing him because you can kill him down here, and it's fantastic. <laughs> he says he's different. And then he doesn't drop him. Nice try. Ship lights every time. There we go. Got past the turrets. You made it through. Well done. Follow me. You're going to love this. Ta -da! Only the turret control center. Thank you very much. We set that guy See that scanner right there? Right? And now it's we deciding just which turret to this window and which to toss. And it's using that master turret again. there as a template. Now, if, if we pull out the Once template the turret, takeover, it'll I'm shut down the whole production line. And clean out some trash and right. get ready to take um, another shot. So I'm going to have to hack the door. So that we can get at it. Can't watch him hack the door. Break the glass. Um, you'll need to turn around while I do this. And then after he breaks the glass, done. So, so we can go boom, boom. Pull okay, go on. Just pull out. that turret out. Well, pull him that out should there. do it. Let Temple him blow up down here. Continuing from memory. 
Toxin generator is at, and we shut that down. As soon as we shut that down, it'll send us into a pipe for a uh, cinematic, a cutscene, whatever you want to call it. And then we'll be uh, like one room away from the Glados fight, so we're almost to the Wheatley takeover here. Ha! I knew Bunny we were going the right way. Bunny hop the this is the neurotoxin right. generator. We'll Bit bigger than I expected. Uh, not going to be able to just you know push it over. Have to apply some cleverness. There's some sort of control room up at the top. So uh, let's go and investigate. Investigate the control room up top, where Wheatley's going to be very scary to be pressing a button here in about 10 seconds. I'm afraid the door is locked. What are you doing? We don't want that button. that. Good news. I can use this equipment to shut down the neurotoxin system. It is, however, password protected. Ah, alarm bells. No, don't worry, all right? Do you smell the neurotoxin? Hold on, the neurotoxin levels are going down. Hold on, something's wrong. Neurotoxin levels up to 50%. No, it's dang. Sorry, my mistake. I meant to say it's dang 50%. It's good news. Carry on. wait at the door. That did it. Neurotoxin at 0%. Yes. Hold on. Warning. Neurotoxin pressure has reached dangerously unlethal levels. So now we have our uh, air duct cinematic. Then we'll get into, I'll do like one little small uh, level kind of thing that'll take me into GLaDOS's fake room where she'll try and kill me. The first time. They should take us right to her. I can't believe I'm finally doing this. Woo! <laughs> I knew this would be fun. They told me it wasn't fun at all. So they said it's not fun at all. And I, I, I believed them. I thought I was a fool to myself. Oh, and I'm, I'm, lo I'm loving this. Way another time. Okay, here we go. Now we're ready for the second half of the game. This place is yeah, huge. We're coming, we're I'm really seeing the, the top layer. Already. It goes down for miles. All sealed off years ago, of course. The second half of the game's about an hour. We should be hour, getting close. Oh, I cannot wait to see the look on her face. Hour, no so neurotoxin, yeah. no turret. Oh, She'll never know what hit her. <laughs> hold on, hold on, because I, I, mm, I might not have thought this next part completely. Ah! Well, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm going away, the wrong way. He goes down and we Get go to her. I'll find you. And then, like you. I said, this will drop me onto a staircase. Uh, I'll walk around the dumbest handrail in the entire game. I don't know why they didn't just make it a straight rail. You, you'll see what I'm talking about right here. It's really stupid. So when they drop you out of this rail, look, see this curve in the rail? If you go straight forward, you'll run right into that. Why is that there? Stupid. I don't know. I don't. I really don't know. Small GLaDOS fake room where there's a cake dispensary. And, I honestly, and I know the path is, or the, think you'd fall the split for that. in the floor is going to happen right here. So in fact, I, just stand I devised right here and a wait much more elaborate trap further ahead for when you got through and then this as it starts easy moving, you kind of like jog back. If I'd known you so let you yourself get captured this easily, I would have just dangled a turkey leg on a rope from like the ceiling. Juggle yourself. There we go. Well, it was nice catching up. Let's get to business. And GLaDOS' I first interaction stronger than coming up on the Wheatley Takeover in about, no, Otherwise, I'm afraid you're about like to become the immediate past president of the Being Alive Club. Uh -huh. She's got to go through her rigmarole. Seriously, Doug. Goodbye. It's my big chance. This is trouble. Oh, this is... Oh, you were 
busy back there. Well, I suppose we could just sit in this room and glare at each other until somebody drops dead. But I have a better idea. It's your old friend, Deadly Neurotoxin. If I were you, I'd take a deep breath and hold it. And look who it is! Hello. It's Wheatley! I hate you so much. Warning, Central Core is 80% corrupt. That's funny. I don't feel corrupt. In fact, I feel pretty good. Alternate Core detected. Oh, that's me they're talking about! To initiate a core transfer, please deposit Substitute Core in receptacle. Torch. Substitute so Core accepted. Substitute Core. Are you ready to start the procedure? Yes. Blue portal there and there's no stuff core. The portal. Right Are you ready to start the, the procedure? procedure? No. Oh, yes, she is. No, 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 no. Stalemate detected. Transfer procedure cannot continue. Yes. Unless a stalemate associate is present to press the stalemate okay. resolution button. Not so fast. Think about this. You need to be a train. There we go. And split. Completely take over. Right at an hour. That's Wait, great. What if this hurts? I'm gonna try and glitch this, this really elevator, hurts? but I, I've watched oh, some speedrunners do this. I oh, haven't been able to do it Believe myself yet. But me, it will. I'm gonna try and you, get up on top of the elevator, really hurt? and then once it starts going you're, up, I'll jump no, off of it so I can get underneath it. So when it starts going down, it pushes me down and pushes me to the end of the level faster, to the level exit. No! 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 It's it's kind of a tricky jump. I think I've landed on it once, but I don't think I've ever been able to. Well, I landed on it and forgot how the glitch worked, so I got on there, got excited, and jumped off too. We did it! So. I'm in control of the whole facility now. Whoa! Ho -ho. Would you look at this? Not too bad. This will be the point Giant after I stop massive. here, or after uh, I get right in the right elevator. Here, this will be the point right? where I'm going to get up and uh, oh, right, go yeah, get another drink and come there. back and just kind of, you know, just kind of take go. a lap. Because Crap! I missed it. Look how small you are down there. <laughs> I was talking. I could barely see you. Oh, uh, okay. Hold on. All right. I'll be right back. Cool There's a lot. This is like two minutes of crap. So. Wow, this is cool. I think it's maybe. And check this out. I'm a bloody genius now. Estás usando este software de traducción de forma incorrecta. Por favor, consulte el manual. I don't even know what I just said, but I can find out. Oh, sorry. No, the lift. Yes, sorry. Forget <laughs> This body is amazing. Seriously, I can't get over how small you are, but I'm huge. <laughs> Actually, why do we have to leave right now? Do you have any idea how good this feels? I did this. Tiny little Wheatley did this. You didn't do anything. She did all the work. Oh, really? That's what the two of you think, is it? Whoa. Maybe it's time I did something then. What are you doing? No, no, no. And don't think I'm not onto you too, lady. You know what you are? Selfish. I've done nothing but sacrifice to get us here. And what have you sacrificed? Nothing. Zero. All you've done is boss me around. Well, now who's the boss? Who's the boss? It's me. Ah! See that? That is a potato battery. It's a toy for children. See, he and hasn't even knocked me down into the elevator it. yet, and I'm still like... <laughs> it's crazy. This is a long uh, dialogue. I can't do anything until the very bottom of the elevator. That's when, that's when I get to start moving again. Yeah, it's crazy. Attention. Intelligence dampening sphere on me. It clung to my brain like a tumor. Generating... Well, I'm just going to check my phone real quick. Ideas. No, not listening. Oh, not listening. Nothing listening. happened. No, you, no, you're lying, yes. you're lying. You were the tour. You're not just a regular moron. You were designed to be a moron. I am not a moron! Yes, you are. You're a moron they built to make me an idiot. Well, how about now? Now who's a moron? Could a moron punch you into this pit? Ah! Could a moron do that? Oh, okay, we go. Okay, we officially have been knocked into the elevator shaft. Oh, there's a doggo. And a doggo entered the room. She's keeping watch. Oh, hi. Oh, 
Oh yeah, and this is another another two or three minutes of just fall time. I think it's like two minutes. So the next um, the next split that I will do will be when I open the double doors to the entrance of the aperture enrichment center. Basically, the first time you hear Cave Johnson's voice, I'm gonna I'm gonna hit the split. Yeah, I think it's two minutes of dialogue. Ah, maybe like a minute and a half, 90 seconds. Those glados. And okay, we're back at it. We can finally move again. Try and bunny hop our way very meagerly through this section of the map. because I'm timing myself. Please be in the right spot. Okay, I, just, I didn't double check that portal. I just went with it. Just went with it, boys and girls. sections are killer for me because I'm not the world's best bunny hopper. I'm not even a, I don't even consider myself a bunny hopper. Like I'm not, I'm not very good at that stuff. So I haven't spent a lot of time practicing this stuff. Portal there, portal there, just as some quick entrance portals. And then we do a portal here and a portal here. Hit the button, run across, hit the other button, and we open the gate. This is where the uh, Aperture Science Enrichment Center is located, under this gigantic door here. Normally I don't watch it open, but for the sake of the speed run. jump button is set for the same as my zoom out button like uh, it's the mouse wheel um i need to i've been meaning to change that i just haven't ever and so everyone because i never use zoom so every once in a while my finger will roll up on the mouse wheel and i'll zoom in and it's really hard to get it to zoom out it's the same function as jump so you almost have to like put brakes on essentially and then and then roll the mouse wheel back i don't it's hard to explain that's a good bunny hop in here not so bad move pretty quick across that segment there Okay, next split coming up. This is where I'll hit the door. This double door right here is my next split. And... Split. Welcome, gentlemen, to Aperture Science. Astronauts, war heroes, Olympians, you're here because we want the best. And you are it. So, who is ready to make some science? I am. <laughs> now, you already met one another on the limo ride over, so let me introduce myself. I'm Cave Johnson. I own the place. That eager 
voice you heard Dave Johnson. Like Carol, now I insist to perform we'll get a little bit of dialogue over that here. Sorry about that. I can't personally oversee every one of them, so these pre-recorded messages will cover any questions you might have and respond to any incidents that may occur in the course oh of your God, science adventure. <laughs> Your test assignment Ooh, will vary that's... depending on the manner in which you have bent the world okay, to your spot will. Here where you can pre -shoot Those of you portal, helping us test the repulsion time, gel today, just follow the blue line it's on the floor. Right on top of that Those of you who volunteered to be catwalk. injected with praying mantis DNA, I've got some is. good news and some bad news. Bad news is goes. we're postponing those catwalk. tests indefinitely. So now, I just good have news to is run out we've got a much better test for you. Fighting an army of mantis men. Pick up a rifle and follow the yellow line. You'll know when the test starts. Clear that staircase. Clear that staircase. And then just drop the orange portal. And we are across the gap. Boom. Money hops the door. Yep. Nailed it. This is my first uh, couple switches here. Oh, it's single switch for alpha. That's right. I'm going to shoot a portal up in that little spot there. And shoot another one there. And just run straight to the end of this thing. Outside again. They say great science is built on the shoulders of giants. There, there we go. Not here. At Aperture, we do all our science from scratch. We're on our way no into the training holding. facility, ladies and gentlemen. The next one will be our blue gel intro. I may have already triggered that one. Maybe I should have already punched, but we'll see. Nope, because that's this one. So I'm going to run. I'm going to go ahead and hit the, um, the split right, right when I enter this, uh, this next this first test involves something the lab boys gel. call repulsion gel. Repulsion You're gel. not so part of the control the group, intro, by the way. So you get the gel. Split. Last poor son of a gun got blue paint. <laughs> All joking aside, that did happen. Broke every bone in his legs. Tragic, but informative. Or so I'm told. boys just informed me that I should not have mentioned the control group. They're telling me I ought to stop making these pre-recorded messages. That gave me an idea. Make more pre-recorded messages. I pay the bills here. I can talk about the control group all damn day. For this next test, we put nanoparticles in the gel. In layman's terms, that's a billion little gizmos that are going to travel into your bloodstream and pump experimental genes and RNA molecules and so forth into your tubers. Now, maybe you don't have any tubers. Well, don't worry. If you set out a bowling chair in the Oh, that was a lazy, that was a lazy portal. I should have had that placed already. Definitely should have had that one placed already. But that's alright. I'm being kind of lazy to run anyway, so not a huge loss. So the next one, whenever we see the orange gel come into play, that will be the next time that I uh, split. I think it's here in a couple of rooms. Did I make it? Ah, oh, missed it. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> That's another one I've never missed. <laughs> oh, in case you got covered in that repulsion gel, here's some advice the lab boys gave me. Do not get covered in the repulsion gel. We haven't entirely nailed down what element it is yet, but I'll tell you this, it's me. a Who lively one, and it oh, does not like me. the human skeleton. Hmm. Yeah, well, I'll call you back, Stan. Speed running. I'm almost done. We're probably about, yeah, about 45 minutes from the end, I think. As long as I, excuse me, as long as I can play the next maps appropriately, we'll be fine. All these science spheres are made of asbestos, by the way. Keeps out the rats. Oh, Let us know well, if you like feel I said, a shortness as long as I can play these the next ones fine, and then it gets soft locked inside of some rails. That's part oh of the my test. God. That's asbestos. Uh, Good news is the lab boys say the symptoms of asbestos poisoning show a median latency of 44.6 years. So if you're 30 or older, you're laughing. Worst case scenario, you miss out on a few... Ha! I like your style. Go, you make up your own rules, there. just like me. Get some being splatter action going. Being covered by the for being in a wheelchair. Get it anyway. Rams are expensive. That one there. That one there. there. Uh, 
and then it's a uh, orange one here. Ooh, I nailed it. Okay, cool, good. Just a heads up, that coffee we gave you earlier had fluorescent calcium in it so we can track the neuronal activity in your brain. There's a slight chance the calcium could harden and vitrify your frontal lobe. Anyway, don't stress yourself thinking about it. I'm serious. Visualizing the scenario while under stress actually triggers the reaction. Load times are a little bit killer too for the speedrun stuff. But that's alright. I'm not perfect. Now, if you're part of control group Kepler 7, we implanted a tiny microchip oh, about the size of a postcard into your skull. Most likely you forgot it's even there. But if it starts vibrating and beeping during this next test, let us know. Because that means it's about to hit 500 degrees, so we're going to need to go ahead and get that out of you pretty come on, fast. Come on, come on, come on. Oh my god, did I miss it? Did I really miss it? <laughs> What is happening in my life? <laughs> oh, this is the terriblest speed run I've ever had. I missed the button. What? Holy cow, dude. Whoa, that took way too long. I lost I'm telling them, keep your 60 pants seconds on. there. All right, this next test may involve okay. trace amounts of time travel. There we so, go. word of advice, if you meet yourself on the testing track, don't make eye contact. Lab boys tell me that'll wipe out time. Entirely. Forward and backward. So, do both of yourselves a favor and just let that handsome devil go about his business. I can't start my bunny hops at all. I'm struggling. Struggling over here, ladies and gents. So let that get covered, and then we just go... Catwalk here. I know. The lab boys say that might be a fear reaction. I'm no psychiatrist, but coming from a bunch of eggheads who wouldn't recognize the thrill of danger if it walked up and snapped their little pink bras, that sounds like protection. They didn't fly into space, storm a beach, yeah, or bring back gold. Those are easy. You and me against the world, son. I like your grit. Hustle could use the work, though. Now let's solve this thing. Yeah, working on it, Cave. Hard to do when the box is just running away from you the whole time. Okay. Why is so much of our science dangerous? Those have been a little rough. Those have been a little bit rough. In fact, why not invent a special safety door that won't hit you on the butt on the way out? Because you are fired! Now you test subject, you're doing fine. Yes, you. Box your stuff. Out the front door. Parking lot. Car. Goodbye. Congratulations. The simple fact that you're standing here listening to me means you've made a glorious contribution to science. Oh, yeah, I'm going to walk all the way back out, so glad I didn't do that. Okay, there's orange activation, so the, since I did the same thing with the blue, I'll wait until the first time I see orange until I actually, uh, which will be, I think in the next room, um, and I'll wait until I actually see the gel flow until I do my split, because that's what I did with blue. It's like Greetings, friend. I'm Cave Johnson, CEO of Aperture Science. You might know us as a vital participant in the 1968 Senate hearings on missing astronauts. And you've most likely used one of the many products we invented, but... There we go. And GLaDOS. Found it. Did you feel that? That idiot doesn't know what he's doing up there. This whole place is going to explode in a few hours if somebody doesn't disconnect him. I can't move. And unless you're planning to saw your own head off and wedge it into my old body, you're going to need me to replace him. We're at an impasse. So what do you say? You carry me up to him and put me back into my body, and I stop us from blowing up and let you go. Oh, wow. You stabbed, stabbed GLaDOS. It feels like I'm outputting an extra
Oh, come on now. Here we go. Oh, no. That wasn't right. That wasn't right. What? Oh, I made it. <laughs> oh, that was not supposed to happen. I wasn't supposed to catch the elevator that soon, but I am not complaining. That was pretty cool. Let's go. Ah, skip dialogue. That, that, that was the fastest I've ever done that because I screwed up. Cool. Oh, okay, so this is the first map where I'm going to see orange gel, so when I hit this through, button, I will split. You'll get your 60 bucks. Care on, are the compensation vouchers ready? Yes. As soon as I hit this button, I'll hit the split. And split. We'll get ourselves some quick gel going. Right there. the other side. Nice thing about this repulsion gel is you, it makes you it makes it very easy to bunny hop. Which is always nice. The next one will be the white gel that uh, that I timestamp. Um, not we know that. entirely we just sure need to relax. where We're that one goes, but. Okay, there's that. That's good to have on the pathway. And then we'll just take the blue one, move it there, and the orange one there, and we'll duck that. tricky because you got to do the backside of the stuff on the building first um, to set up your portal and then set a blue over there so you can get back and leave your orange portal and set up a blue there and just launch it. There we go. Great job, astronaut, war hero, and or Olympian. With that wasn't too help, bad. We're gonna Change the world. <laughs> It's a bit of a confusing map, but hey, we made it through. Down there. We made it through. That thing's called an elevator, not a bathroom. I swear I know him. So I guess that's just how. We'll, and for the white gel intro, it actually the first time you see it is actually at the beginning of an elevator. So as soon and it's a continuous elevator; it doesn't uh, load level like that. So when I see the white gel, I'll just I'll just hit the. If you're the interested in an additional sixty dollars, flag down a test associate and let him know. You could walk out of here with a hundred and twenty weighing down your bindle if you let us take you apart, put some science stuff in you, and then put you back together. Good as new. Come on, repaint that. There you go. And then we got to put blue up there and blue right there. Oh, sent one, sent one little drop. Come on, come on, come on. It just takes forever to get this stuff to go. And then orange. Uh, that's fine. A lot of big jumps in this level. I kind of like it, but it can be confusing. It kind of is a little bit confusing. You got to do this. First, you have to. Uh, oh no, shit. See, this is why it's confusing. So you gotta go back up top. You gotta reset your gel mixture. Pour right there. Oh, come on, get in there. Yep, and then that'll spray that. And then now you can go back down there. The button, come back out of it. And now we have to respray for here. So you do a little respray there. And then orange here. Oh, whoops, and then orange here, here. And we come back to this, we go blue there, and we launch. End of the level, right here. Oh, is that enough? Yeah, it is. In case you're interested, there's still some positions available for that bonus opportunity that I mentioned too bad. earlier. Again, all you gotta do is let us disassemble you. We're not banging rocks together here, we know how to put a man back together. It might be this one. So, that's a complete reassembly. New vitals, spit shine on the old ones, plus we're scooping out tumors. Frankly, you ought to be paying us. Nope, maybe one more. Yeah. 
Must be one more then before the white gel intro. Thank you. I can't believe I'm thanking these people. For staggering your oh, way through yeah, Aperture Science's like propulsion sense. gel testing, you've made some real contributions to society for a change, and for that, humanity is grateful. If you had any belongings, please pick them up now. We don't want old newspapers and sticks cluttering up the building. For many of you, I realize $60 is an unprecedented windfall, so don't go to the And here comes the white gel, oh A, B, and C. But I'm not going to tag it yet because I didn't do that with the other ones. So. A lot of this is just... Oh, come on. There's another one of those crappy moves. Oh, boy. So now I can walk. Let's see. Here. Okay. Man, I'm having some bummer luck on this run. But I assume I'm not uh, alone in that. I have to replant my blue. Good for him. All right, back to thinking. And funny, hop up the stairs. Whoa, caught some air. Welcome to the enrichment center. <coughs> Since making test participation mandatory for all employees, the quality of our test subjects has risen dramatically. Employee retention, however, has not. As a result. You may have heard we're going to phase out human testing. There's still a few things left to wrap up, though. Now, the bean counters told me we literally could not afford to buy $7 worth of moon rocks, much less $70 million. Million. Bought them anyway. Round them up, mixed them into a gel. So I'm working Guess on the dialogue. Round up moon million. rocks are pure poison. I am deathly ill. Still, it turns out they're a great portal conductor. Okay, so I think this is the white. We're going to see if jumping in and out yep. of these new portals so can, can somehow leach the lunar the poison gel, so out of a man's split. bloodstream. When life gives you lemons, make lemonade. <laughs> Let's all stay positive and do some science. That said, I would really appreciate it if you could test as fast as possible. Carolyn, please bring me more pain pills. That was the fastest I've ever made it out of that chamber, which is really, really nice. Uh, that does not normally happen to me, so that's good. Some things are going okay. We just gotta spray this wall with some some of the uh, white gel, ah, the white gel. Now here, oh, come out here on this tall railing. And then you gotta do a blue and an orange, all through the orange, and away we go. Airborne. All right, I've been thinking. When life gives you lemons, don't make lemonade. Make life take the lemons back. Get mad. I don't want your damn lemons. What am I supposed to do with these? Yeah, take the lemons. Demand to see life's manager. Make life rule the day and thought it could give Kane Johnson lemons. Do you know who I am? I'm the man who's going to burn your they house down. They say zoom view here, but I just go up to the tallest one and engineers shoot until I hit something. See? It works. You don't have to zoom in this game. Burns your house down. <laughs> There's uh, this one plus... Uh, that one, Point and that is, put us up if we can store music on a compact a disc, why can't we store a man's intelligence and personality on one? And then just so I have the engineers smash. figuring that out now. And then we'll Brain do a blue magic. one there. Artificial and intelligence. then we'll we come back up and hit a blue one there. Oh, and an orange one there. I'm going to say it on tape so everybody hears it a hundred times. Hey, I got it. All right, I kind of... Oh, that was rough. <laughs> I struggled my way through that part. I missed the last blue portal, or the orange portal, but I was close. Uh, not too bad. Not too bad. I normally have to stop and redo that part I at least once, that so crazy not too bad. Was right. Let's not take these lemons. We are going to march right there back upstairs here. and make him put me back in my body. And he'll probably kill us because he's incredibly powerful and I have no plan. Three of them should wow. be good. Again? Oh, whoa, well, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, I screwed it up. Of course I did, because I'm speedrunning. That's how this game works, everyone. And where am I at? There we are. Okay, so we got to hit that. Redo this. Here we go. Now we're flying. And then we got to come back over here. Shoot an orange portal in there. There we go. Jump down here. 
shoot the blue portal here, I think. Uh, yeah, and then shoot the blue portal there, and away we go! We made it. If you're wondering where I'm at right now and what I just went through, don't ask because I cannot even tell you. I just know those are the jumps that you gotta make. Yeah, I'm blowing it again. Don't worry, I'm just screwing up. It's fine. There we go. We're gonna walk up here. We get very disoriented because of the map layout. We're gonna shoot a portal there. And we're gonna shoot an orange one here and walk through it. We're gonna shoot an orange portal or a blue portal right up there above that staircase. Orange one here. Come down and find our next jump. Blue there. Orange here. And our next jump is complete. She's not gonna like that I pressed the button first. And I did, and she's still not. Look, I'm looking right at. Oh, she did get it. Okay, cool. Normally, if you hit the button right away, and she tells you to go look at the poster, she's, it'll still glitch, and she'll go, Oh, I guess you didn't have time for that. And then she'll move on. But I guess it worked that time. So now we wait for the elevator. Um, oh, I didn't. I forgot to. Ah, that's okay. I'll split here. I forgot to split when the when I first saw the white gel, uh, unfortunately, but that's okay. Um, once these three pipes connect, right? Now, that's my next split. Connect the pipes. Uh, so I screwed up that split. That's fine. That's fine. The next uh, split that I'm going to make is going to be what I call a weekly surprise. That's when, uh, here in a couple maps, he's going to say, I've got a surprise for you, blah, 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 blah. We'll go through a few more maps, and then he'll... We'll come into this certain map, and he'll spring us off to the left, and as soon as we hit that spring, I will split it again, because then it'll save the surprise. Until then, we have a nice slow elevator ride up to the top, which means I can take another shot. Oh, crap. Sorry, man. Today. Okay, so it's not the most watertight plan to go confront an omnipotent power mad AI with. Still, it's a better plan than exploding. Marginally. Okay, we're we're uh we're close. We're we're getting close now. Once you pass the uh, aperture enrichment center and you get back into the facility, you're pretty close. There's For God's sake, your boxes 13, with 11, legs. Chapters, it's, it's literally your only purpose. Walking onto bugs. How can you not do the one? Warmer, warmer, boiling hot, boil. Okay, colder, colder, ice cold, you're Arctic now. It's, you're, you're very cold, very, very, and these very last cold. Maps, I Just get on well. the button. Cause oh, I've, that's you know, funny, is it? It's oh, it's funny, game, because we've been in this for 12 well, hours, like and you haven't solved it either, so I don't know why you're laughing. Most, so. You've got one hour! Solve it! I can move through these ones pretty quick, I think, for the most part. Ah, <laughs> yes! 
I just don't watch any of the dialogue here. I just wait for them. I just wait for them to have their little argument. Um, and then we, uh, and then we just move true. on. True. I'll go true. Yeah, that was easy. I'll be honest, I might have read that one before then. Sort of cheating. It's a paradox. There is no answer. Look, this place is going to blow up if I don't get back in my body. Uh, false. I'll go false. Explosion <laughs> imminent. I'll go false. Evacuate the facility Hold on. immediately. Before I fix that. Warning. Reactor core is at critical. There. Fixed. Hey, it is great seeing you guys Come again. on now. Seriously. Come um, on now. It turns out I'm a little bit short Open the door. on test subjects right now, so this works out perfect. And off we go. There we go. You have no idea what it's like in this body. I have to test all the time, or I get this, this itch, you know? It must be hardwired into the system or something. Oh, but I tell you, when I do test, oh, oh man alive. Nothing feels better. It's just, I'm just that's why I've got to test. That's why I've got to test. So you're going to test, and I'm going to watch. And everything is going to be just Morning. Core right. overheating. First Nuclear very difficult medium test coming up here. Designed this test myself. It's a little bit different. Very complicated oh, test. Oh, yes. Oh. That felt really good. And we just wait oh, here instead of going idea. to the end. Since making tests is so do it again. Why don't you just keep solving this test? Say so what? And I can just like, watch you solve it. Yeah, that, that sounds much easier. Here we go. And. So you just do this test twice a time. Nothing. Alright, can't blame you for trying. Okay, new tests. New tests. Gotta be some tests around here somewhere. Oh, here we go. Fast elevator, that's nice. That's always nice. It shouldn't be hard to stay alive long enough to find him. It's alright! Everything's good, I just invented some more tests. This is one of my tests. I remember this test. I screwed this one up royally on my last speed run. I was trying it, I completely forgot what I was supposed to be doing in this test, so yeah, I screwed it up really bad and it ended up costing me a bunch of time, but I will not make that mistake again. Hopefully. I still am a little wary on this one, but uh, we should be okay for the most part. So just gotta do that. No! Nope. You stay down here, punk. We'll get him down here. And then we gotta put uh, that there. And that there. And then grab him. There we go. Now he's good. So now I just wait for him to hit the thing. And we're out of here. That wasn't too bad. It was kind of screwy there, but we're good. So That's probably one of the faster the times I've done that one, so. So they can kill us. The good news is, well, not so far, to be honest. I'll get back to you on that. Ugh, it wasn't, wasn't a fast elevator. That's okay. I was hoping I could make up some time with those with those uh, new elevators, but I'm about 50%. I'd love to help you solve the tests, but I can't. Sorry. You're on your own. Yeah, made this test myself out of smaller tests that I found lying around. Jammed them all together. Buttons, got funnels, bottomless pits are involved. It's got it all. It's got it all. Alright, okay, this is taking too long, okay? I'll just tell you how to solve the test, okay? See that button over there, alright? You just need. Ah! And that's why I can't help you solve the tests. <sighs> oh, son of a bitch, I shriveled that one. Fuck. Oh, come on! Never mind. Never mind, solve it yourself. There we go, okay. You're Crap. <laughs> I got button happy. <laughs> oh, yes. Well done. Thanks. All we had to do was pull that lever. What? Well, no, you pressed the button. I know we're in a lot of trouble and probably I think, I, uh, I, think I jumped the gun on that one. Oh, nice! Fast elevator! That's legit. I'm trying to think. There's one coming up that I get confused on a lot. Oh, no, this one's easy. This one's super easy. I'm coming! Coming! Don't start yet! Don't start yet! You are not gonna believe this. I found a sealed off wing. Hundreds, hundreds of perfectly good test chambers just sitting there. Filled with skeletons. Shook them out. Good as new. 
just got to uh, do that. Set my first two portals, and then every other portal is going to be orange from now on. So I'll just wait here. Oh, this area. There we go. Stand here. There we go. Oh, on our way. Be honest, you can't even tell, can you? Seamless. quick also that wasn't too bad not too bad at oh all. here we go here it comes i've missed that i've missed that little oh, jump at the end disappointed too. by putting the box in front of you it hits the switch first um you can hit that uh that box uh what was i gonna say oh that box will hit the switch before you get to it and if you have to jump behind it like i did you can miss that platform and have to redo that whole section it's really stupid So, yeah, that's kind of a sketchy jump to go behind the box. Right. So that last test was seriously right disappointing. Like Apparently, being civil isn't motivating you. So let's well, let's try her way, all right? Oh, oh, fatty, oh, 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 oh. adopted got about, got fatty. Homeboy here. fatty, fatty, no parents. There what? We go. Now that. What's, what's wrong with being adopted? Uh, uh, well, um, lack of parents. For the record, you are adopted and that's terrible. And also, nothing. But so, well, some of my best friends actually are orphans. Also, but look at her, you moron. She's not fat. I am not a moron. Just do the test. Just do the test. It's not enough. If I'm such a moron, too why bad. can't you solve a simple test? Could have moved a little quicker. I'm gonna push that moron thing a little too far this time. Ouch. That's gonna be a long elevator. That eh, wasn't too bad. I definitely jumped the gun on that one, though. Whoops. <laughs> one of my favorite maps. Because the classical music and his dialogue in this one is hilarious. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. sorry. I, hope that, I hope that didn't disturb you too much. Then it was the sound of books, pages being turned. So that was just what I was doing, just reading uh, books. So not a moral. Anyway, just finish the last one. Just now the hardest one, Machiavelli. Do not know what all the fuss was about. Understood it perfectly. Have you read that one? Yeah. Yeah, thanked it. Well, on with the test. Oh, oh what? what was that? That was nothing. That was nothing. Me. Just moving uh, this, the old test chamber a little bit closer really kind to of me. Um, kind of tough. Maybe um, proximity to the test sure solving. Right spot. Give but us it did. Holy oh, crap, it did. What was um, that? Oh, sorry. You gotta just, like, come down here. You gotta snag this. There we go. That actually wasn't too bad. Uh, there. Oh, there we are. Look at that. I'll grab that. Ah, missed me that time. Oh, you were sorry. You were sorry. Sorry. Never mind, Carol. My fault. Hopefully that cut off the lasers. It did. Sweet. That was actually not too bad. I didn't know I screwed are it up. You, are you absolutely sure you're solving these correctly? I mean, yes, you solved it, but I'm wondering if maybe there's a number of ways to solve them and you're picking all the worst ways. No, no, that was the solution. Ah, what am I missing? I think fast elevator? No, nah, medium. It's going to be a recurring uh, quote. For the rest of the game, fast elevator. This is where, like I said, these are the puzzles that I can get through pretty quick. So I'm gonna try and get these ones done as fast as I can. Have a I'm gonna tape you oh, this solving one's, this these one's tough. and then watch ten at once. Get a more sort of concentrated burst of science. Oh, on a related note, I am gonna need you to solve these ten times as fast. 
Anyway, uh, just give me a wave, would you, before you solve this one, alright? I don't want to the ending for when I watch it later. Jesus, screw that up, so that's good. We will block off the lasers. Oh, come on. I hate these stupid blocks. Okay, uh, then we have to get back up there. And then now we have to shoot that. And that. Just walk into it. See ya! This, we're actually going to replace that box right there with this box. Aim it straight at the wall. We go blue there. We go. Bring this up right there. Place this box. Oh, right. That'll work. Um, then we have to put a blue box there, or a blue circle there. And a blue circle there. First one down. We put a blue circle there. Then we put a blue circle there and an orange circle there. Put a blue circle there and an orange circle there. Done. This map is complete, everyone. And you just put an orange circle there. Oh, you just solved it, didn't you? I, I told you to tell to tell you. Uh, orange circle, orange circle. Why are you making this so hard for me? Remember when I told you that he was specifically designed to make bad decisions? Because I think he's decided not to maintain any of the crucial functions. That I think is one of the harder puzzles uh, in the game. That one and maybe the one before it. So getting through those pretty quick is kind of crucial, which is nice. I don't feel like I struggled. There's actually one. It might be this one coming up. That's a little bit more difficult than those. But if you know the beta, it's not too bad. It's just about putting things in the right spot. This place is self-destructing, you idiot. Was. Was self-destructing. Already fixed. Programmed yeah, this one's a little bit tougher. Tremor for all time's sake. Two. Like one or two more uh, tremors in there it. just for fun. Morning. It's just kind Come of a waiting game on this one. I know you keep job. I'm not a monster. Ignore what he's saying. So. Just keep on testing. Again. And there again. This one is. It's nice because they put grid lines on the on the cubes or on the blocks you're supposed to hit, so you can cross over. Into, and it's pretty easily noticeable. Wait for it to go back across. Why is it not hitting the thing? Oh, come on, man. <laughs> oh, whatever, game. Oh, that is, oh, that's crap. Oh, that is humongous, humongous crap, dude. <laughs> oh, my God. I have to do this whole puzzle again. I have to do this entire puzzle again, man. Oh, my God. That is, look at it. There it goes. Disintegrated. Oh, it stayed. Oh, it stayed. Okay, so I don't have to do the whole puzzle again. Well, at least the cube stays. That's nice. Come on, pick it up. There you go, girl. And there. You, I... Up! <laughs> no way! <laughs> no way did that just happen to me. <laughs> oh, that was good. That was good stuff right there, folks. That just rolled off. That was amazing. So now you guys get to see me do this puzzle twice. So this is how you do this puzzle if you're doing it twice. Right here, right here. Make sure that sits in the laser. And then you throw a blue portal here and a blue portal oh, there. Still Let's keep moving. Holy crap. Holy crap, I lost a lot of time right there. <laughs> To your left, you'll see some lights. Of oh, some that was so bad. <laughs> very and to your right, right. something cheers for that. Cheers for that really horrible, true. horrible oh, run God, I just had. Not supposed to be there. Are you all right back there? Here, I'll turn the beam on. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no, 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 that's not helpful. That I, uh, I don't know 
what is that would happen? Oh, that was a big shot of vodka. I mean, water. We're getting close, though, folks. We're getting pretty close. Huh. This, is, this is the one that Great. I think is a little bit more. Yeah, just uh, getting a uh, test ready um, for you, obviously. But if you know the beta, no it's not. So, exit. let's see here. Exit, exit, exit. There is no exit. Not a problem. I'll just I'll make an exit for your test. And he's over there making a bunch of noise, but we don't have to worry about what he's doing right now. Perfect. Probably good. I'll be honest, after you told me to turn that beam off, I thought I had lost you. We're poking around for other test subjects. No luck there. Everyone's still dead. But, oh, I did Where'd find something, though. Fixed. Reminds me. I've got a big surprise for you two. Seriously, look forward to it. And I usually die on this part, so this should be really, really interesting to see how this goes. Because I usually get too risky and try and do something stupid. Hopefully that's yep it is. That's it. That was a good oh. You two are gonna love this big surprise. In fact, you might say you're going to love it to death. So love it quick word of advice. If you're speedrunning this game and you fly across the Grand Canyon gap right there and you are holding the forward button when you land in the, the tunnel uh, on the other side. If you're still holding forward, it will slingshot you out the other side. It almost happened to me right there, and you'll die. And you have to redo the, the map from, like, the checkpoint or whatever. But it's a pain in the ass. So, <laughs> word of advice, watch yourself on that part. This could be the actual surprise. Uh, we may be doing a... Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Here we go. Oh, no, it's not. No, it's not. It's not. Sorry. Sorry, my fault. We got to get over to the other side. Either way, the there we go. Only three more chambers okay, I know, to your big I know surprise. This, map. this map's great. I love this map. It's really great. So we just gotta get over there first. Boom. Alright. And then we have our blue portal that's gonna cross over that. That's perfect. Just a little bit there. Put the orange portal back in. Jump in there before the goop. Oh, there's one following me real close. Okay, okay, this part's a little confusing. Uh, we gotta jump out here. Hit the reverse button. It's blue, so orange is gonna go there, okay. So we have to wait for it all to get back in the top funnel. Then we have to jump off the funnel, or jump off the button and replace our portal with that one. Did it work? Oh, it worked, woo! It might not hit all of them, but we're gonna try. It didn't. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, that's a bummer. So I get to play this one twice, too. Yay. Speed runs. Yay, speed runs. All because I didn't place my orange portal right on the other side. It's kind of a kind of stupid. But that one little guy there just surviving like a jerk. So we get to try again. All for him, which is nice. There he goes. All right. So each one of these puzzles has taken me at least an extra 30 seconds because of dealing with uh, the turrets and just missing portals where they're supposed to be. So that's been really nice. <laughs> and we jump here, oh. and we're at the end of the Good. Good one. Good for you. So he's inexplicably happy all of a sudden, even though he should be going out of his mind with test withdrawal. Crap, that's a long elevator for sure. Oh, that was a super quick elevator. All right, see, I don't know how it works. I don't know. I should probably do some research on this if I'm going to continue to do it. And at some point I will, but I'll get like I'll 10 of them under my belt before I start looking at tips and tricks on how to what your big surprise is. Well, only two more there chambers. There we go. Yeah, this is the surprise, so we're going to be doing another split right here after we hit this uh, the switch. There we go. Surprise! The We're surprise. Doing it there. So, from here on, we only have the final boss fight left. And I'm probably 10 minutes or so from that. 
So we'll be just a little bit behind of my uh, my previous run where I ti started timing later, actually. So to be honest, this really isn't that bad. For me, anyways. I'm sure it's horrible for other runners, but I'm not a part of that community yet, so. All right, here we go. The part where he kills us. Hello. This is the part where I kill you. Had a bit of a brainwave. There I was, smashing some steel plates together. And I thought to myself, yeah, it's... No, 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 no. Don't do that. Don't. Stand right here. Stand. Oh. No, there we go. All right, now we're back. on the run. Come back, please. We are officially... We were running okay, from GLaDOS look, in the beginning, and now we're running not from gonna kill you in the end. Okay, so. if you come back. Oh... Just thinking back to the old times, the old days when we were friends, good old friends, not enemies. And I would say something like, come back, and he'd be like, yeah, no problem, and he'd come back. What happened to those days? There we go. Can't help but notice that you're not coming back. You're just disappointed. Oh, I've got an idea. Oh, whoa, that was a little bit higher yes, than I Yes, in what? your face, I got my... That was, I did not need to place that portal that high off the ground. <laughs> oh, well, it worked. I don't care. I do like the music. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm almost there. Don't mind me. Continue escaping. Ha! Ah, damn trap! Are they killing you? Ha! Was that your bullet? Riddle bullet fly out of the room? It was oh, those were the crap turrets, weren't they? Yeah. Well, no matter, because I'm still holding all the cards. And guess what? They're all full houses. They're actually playing cards, meaning to learn. Anyway, new turret, not defective. Oh. Don't shoot me I in the back. See. Okay, I thought it was. Clever. He was Very clever. And foolish. Spinny blade wall. No. Well, spinny good, blade wall. Good. Finally, a nemesis worthy of my vast intellect. Okay, that Holmes wasn't really supposed Moriarty. to happen, but whatever. That's fine. Aristotle versus Mashu spike plates. Stay still, please. Ooh, that's close. Oh, that's really All close. Right, oh boy. Moving. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, almost got you there. Almost got you there. Yeah, it was close, Wheatley. You almost actually. Where'd you close. go? Normally, I, I shoot those a little bit quicker, back, back. and uh, you get a little bit bigger gap. That was actually pretty close. I don't know where the game, like, sets its standards at. I'm sure that was pretty close to dying right there. Did something break back there? Oh, oh, did it kill you? That would be amazing if it killed you. Hello? Oh, this oh, part oh, is a little bit time-consuming right because way. you have to kill be a bunch of stupid back. Don't die until I get oh, back. Oh, come on, there we go. Oh, beautiful. I'm gonna go a little bit higher up right there. Would I get him? Uh, almost. Right there. That should, that should nail him. Get him! Plop! Alright, we got him. That's cool. Oh, I did that majorly wrong. Whoops. Of course I did. Because that's kind of how my... Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Because that's how kind of how my run is going. It's just doing things wrong. So. But that's okay. I'm not going to play. Maybe that was the uh, hardest map. It's not really a map. It's kind of an escape. But um, I, I don't think maybe it's, maybe it's not the hardest map. It's just consuming because you have to kill all those turrets with the uh, with the gel. That's kind of a pain in the butt. So it's got to be like right there. There they are. Hey, let's go. So we'll put some orange in there. Oh, don't don't hurt me! Don't hurt me! Don't hurt me! Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Yeah, they like to do that. Okay, so. And we're making our way. And this part will not activate until you actually start running on the little conveyor belt here. So you actually have to start running to the other side, I think. Ah! There you are! And then Great. And then Let's get rid of this. There we go. I wanted to 
to talk to you for a moment, if I may. I'll be honest, the death traps have been a bit of a failure so far for both of us. I think you'll agree. And you are getting very close to my lair. Lair. Here we go. And music starts again. Okay, I love I'll take it. That as a no, then. This is where it gets real dramatic. It's fun. Bunch of blue there. Oh, what's going on? There we go. Orange there. Meet the hallway, and up we go. Into the funnel. Okay, we're coming up to the final boss fight. We're getting really close. This actually isn't too bad. I'm not too far off of where I was at when I started uh, ahead of the first dialogue at five minutes. So, actually, with how bad this run has actually been, <laughs> not doing too bad, time-wise. Two deaths. I only had two deaths, which is, which is pretty good. Not ideal. I would rather have zero deaths. Uh, ideal, so. I figure if I can keep it under three, we do, we do okay. And then small cutscene, and we're making our way up to the final boss fight. And then my last punch or my last split will be right when the trigger releases to shoot the moon. And anyone that's played this game knows what shooting the moon is uh, at the end of the game. Come on, land in there. There you go. Don't you? Uh, don't. There we go. Okay. All right. See, little things like that have been costing me extra seconds. Having to play a few levels twice, like. Mm. <laughs> Especially that last laser level I had to play. That was that was crap. That was crap. <laughs> oh. Okay. So as soon as as soon as we hit the top of the elevator, I will do the split. Here we go. And split. Final boss fight. Here we go. First place I need to stand is ready. Let me just flag something up. According to the control panel light up there, the entire building is going to start. You're not going to see anything for a minute because I'm just going to stand I'm behind this. Sure this is the first it's a problem with the light. The light's on the big. Uh, but just in case fight. it isn't, I am actually going to have, have him blow this tank up with uh, his boss. Discussed earlier. So let's call that three minutes and then a minute break, but we should leave allegedly two minutes to figure out how to shut down whatever is starting all the fires. So anyway, that's the itinerary. Also, I took the liberty of watching the tapes of you killing her, and I'm not going to make the same mistakes. Four-part plan is this. One, no portal surfaces. Two, start the neurotoxin immediately. Three, bomb-proof shields for me. Leading directly onto number four, four, for throwing it you. You know what? This plan is so good, I'm going to give you a sporting chance and turn off the neurotoxin. I'm joking, of course. Good one. Neurotoxin level at capacity in five Here we go. minutes. That's all it takes, gentlemen. And then shoot that one him. That's sounded real. No, that was actually an impression of you. Actually, because you just fell into my trap. My brilliant trap. Just said, I wanted you to trick me. Well, there, first one's going to be up here. See it? I see it. Oh, dude, is it up there? No way, dude. See what I'm saying about weird shit happening? How did he get stuck up on the catwalk? Come on. Oh, boy. Oh, and which side is it? I suppose it's the other side. Yeah, great. Fantastic. Oh, and there's not enough. You appear to jump on. Beautiful. Thank you, game. Fantastic. Core corruption at the going really well. Vent system compromised. Neurotoxin offline. Reactor explosion in four uh, minutes. What, what happened? What happened? What, 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 have you, what have you brought to me? What is that? Hold on. Ah, the bloody bomb. Ah! Oh, there he goes. What's the situation? Oh, hey, how you pretty lady? Hey, Drake. Oh, you out having yourself a little adventure? What, are you fighting that guy? You got that under control? You know, because I think there's a lot of stuff on fire. Let's cut a lot of stuff on Water. fire. Core corruption at 75%. Rick really Reactor cares. explosion timer destroyed. 
Reactor explosion uncertainty. Emergency pre engine. Oh, so this protocol. last one he always Initiate. puts the shields up in this the facility will self destruct in two minutes. Enough! I told you not to put these cores on, but you don't listen, do you? And pop. And so the last one that I need to get is going to be. I'm going to have to go here and about here. Pretty sure. You gotta be out of the way of that or else it won't do that cinematic right there. You need to wait forever. I got him! Okay, we're coming up to the end of the game here. Warning. Core corruption at 100%. So we have to go to the annex. Manual core replacement required. Oh yeah, I have to melt my save anything because I gotta shoot. Substitute He's gonna wash all this crap off. So I can shoot a portal here, and in 10 seconds he's gonna wash all that off. Watch. Interpreting vague answer as yes. No, 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 no! Didn't pick up on my sarcasm. Stalemate detected. Fire detected in the stalemate resolution annex. There's the fire. See, there goes my portal because he got he got wet. That just cleans right off, does it? Well, that would have been good to know a little earlier. So that's fine, right there. And then now I have to press the stalemate resolution button. Do not press that button! And then jump into it. No! And then he's gonna blow me up. Oh. I didn't, I've never done it that quick before, so I didn't are you still alive? Do bypass it. You are okay, shoot the moon, here we go. To be kidding me. This is the last, uh, all I have to do is I'm click, and as soon as the portal goes off, that's time. And I have no idea how to fix this place. Oh. Time. Two hours, four minutes, and 47 seconds. That's not bad. Uh, for starting from scratch this time and letting the whole intro play, I really Space. only lost about 10 minutes for my last run. So, yeah, not bad. Let go! We're in space! Space! Ah, let go! Let go! I'm still connected! I can pull myself in! I can still fix this! I already fixed it. And you are not coming back. Oh no! Change your That's plans. it, guys. Hold on to me. Tighter. That's it. That is the whole game. Portal 2. Uh, it's any percent. Glitchless category. And two deaths and like six level replays. <laughs> Which is not that great. But... That sets my new base time for uh, the rest of the runs that I'm going to do. So uh, now I know that I need to shoot for two hours and four minutes or less. Uh, which is, uh, to, in my opinion, this game, the first time I played through it, I think it took me a week. Uh, there's the co-op. If you've ever played the co-op oh game, those are the God, two characters that you play. Uh, the co-op version of you know, Portal, which is really fun. Karen I recommend it. Get a friend a and play it. It's great. Lesson. I thought you were my greatest enemy. And all along you were my best friend. The surge of emotion that shot through me when I saved your life taught me an even more valuable lesson. Where Carolyn lives in my brain. Carolyn, delete. Goodbye, Carolyn. You know, She's Jimmy cruel, man. Carolyn just now taught She's me a cold. valuable lesson. GLaDOS is cold, everyone. The best solution to a problem she just is killed off Carolyn. the easiest one. And I'll be honest, killing you is hard. You know what my days used to be like? I just tested. Nobody murdered me, or put me in a potato, or fed me to birds. I had a pretty good life. And then you showed up, you dangerous mute lunatic. So you know what? You win. Just go. Oh. It's been fun. Don't come back. the game i'll let the credits roll so you guys can all see it but yeah that's uh that's pretty much it uh, some interesting stuff going on here at the end uh i wish i i wish so bad that they would create a portal 3 i don't know how they're gonna do it i really don't know how they're gonna do it but i wish that they would based on the ending of this game and, and how it ends after you get out of the elevator after you get out of the facility I really wish that they would make a continuance of the game, but I think this came—I think this came out in 2012, and uh, it's now 2020, so it's been eight years. Come on, Valve, let's make another one, shall we?
that was the, the, the Overlord turret that we saw in the beginning of, or the end of that one map. I can't remember which one, but that's the Overlord turret. And then, like, the, and then the actual, like, ultimate turret is back there. The cheetah print turret, the king on, the, the, the crown on, king turret. I guess I should say that's that's uh, Queen Master Turret because that's clearly a woman's voice. It's 2020 though, so don't judge me. I'm just going off of what I hear. This part. This is why I wish they would they would make a Portal 3. I don't know how they're gonna do it, and that's probably why they haven't yet. But like, this is good stuff right here, man. This is very very cliffhangy-ish. To me, maybe it's not supposed to be, but to me, this is a cliffhanger. That's a cliffhanger to me, man. So anyways, that's it. Um, thank you guys for watching. Anyone that does watch, keep an eye out for more because I'm going to keep going with this stuff. So uh, That's going to be it, guys. Thank you.